Okay, in the previous video, I had showed you a brand new download of Driver Detective onto a brand new HP 60 PC. Uh, it had not been registered or anything. We had just a brand new download and install, and then we scanned the computer and found that we had 15 out of date drivers on a brand new PC coming out of the box. So, what I have done is I've gone to Driver Detective now and activated that. I've purchased access into their database so I can uh, download the drivers that I need as opposed to looking all over the internet trying to find those crazy things and hoping that I find one that's up to date. Instead, I've purchased access to their database. It's got a little over 11 million drivers in it. Uh, 250,000 of those are manufacturer specific devices on, on top of just the massive database that they have of generic drivers as well. So what we've done then is I've activated that and now it's the fully functional uh, driver detective. We have scanned the machine. Actually, I'll scan it again just so we see what uh, is out of date. It takes three or four or five seconds for it to scan it and get the result. So we still have the same 15 drivers that are out of date here. So what we do, if you'll notice the key uh, in each one of these, the red X here says that the driver is out of date. It tells you what it is. And then you can follow the legend across uh, the disk there, the floppy disk, is um, the indication to download it. Uh, you can find out more driver installation options if you want to click on the plus sign. And if you happen to run into any questions, you can always click on the uh, button right here, and it will get you uh, connected directly to uh, email service into the support personnel of Driver Detective. So I'm going to uh, download this driver. As you can see, it'll just take just a couple of seconds to download it, about probably 15 or 20, 30 seconds here. And we're pulling this directly from Driver Detectives database now. Uh, one of the latest updated drivers that they have record of. And this is an Intel uh, display adapter is what we're looking at. But now that it's downloaded, we will open it. I've got to go to a different window here and allow them to get on my machine. Accept the terms of the of Intel. Okay, and then we'll just go through the install wizard of installing this adapter. All it's all. And you can see the latest revision of this was March 5, 2009. This is the latest and greatest. It's now installing all the Intel Graphics Media Accelerator. I'm going to pause this video for just a second just so we don't run out of time uh, while the driver can complete its installation and we'll come right back. Okay, so the driver has uh, completed its installation. Uh, it needs me to restart my computer to finish it off, which I'm not going to do while we're doing the video here. So we will finish that off in just a minute. And uh, there you go, just as easy as it can be. So go to pcdriversite.com, as you can see right here pcdriversite.com. Download your copy of Driver Detective and get your PC up and running just as smoothly and as quickly as it possibly can. And we'll see you on the next video.